Nothing boosts my trust and confidence in a brand, sparking the desire to acquire their products as catchy ads, making me question if they think their target audience consists out of idiots or they're just incompetent, especially when they do have a good product. Ah, wrong one. Wooding's keyboard, for example, is top notch. Why on earth would you do this? Hi, name's Alex Crane, and I've been actively using this cloth wrist rest for over four years. And like many, I spend most of my waking moments near the computer, be it work or play. Before the recent events, I was pretty hardcore into reading. But even now, when I get time, I simp anime girls. I mean, play Genshin. And obviously, no one has time to eat in a separate room. So Borch or Pilmeni spills, not counting tryhard sweat and tears, are a semi-regular occurrence. So I try to watch both my mouse pad, wrist pad, and even the keyboard every other month. Apparently, I just solved the biggest problem with a cloth wrist rest is that it's impossible to clean. Ta-da! Literally, clean it dozens of times. No white spots, nothing. Yeah, you don't put it in the washing machine. But neither do you put your keyboard in a dishwasher or clean your ears above a drill. The box it came with is sturdy and survived Ukarbochta, so I wouldn't worry about personal trips. Stitches are all intact, the grip, superb, and most importantly, the cool gel memory foam. Still makes me pick it over other wrist rests for gaming. For work, I use this one. With a hidden compartment, soon to be reviewed. Only complaint in four years is the issue I talked about in my initial review. Only worsened, but it's mostly a visual thing. So unless your whole personality results around desk set of pictures, I would totally get one. Especially now when they come in various sizes. Do you own a cloth wrist rest? How's it Asian? Share in the comment section and see ya.